this is the comfortable outfit of the day i just have on hold on let me see something just finished cleaning my room and we're about to hit these streets for a hot second i have a few things i want to work on this week in the home so i figure i'll take y'all with me i have on my tarjay um um the little hermes dupes and then this oversized dress that has pockets i got this from crazy boss a long time ago for five bucks i have a bunch of these some like this some are high neck some are um we're cross across the front but all these dresses are normally like five dollars there and my room just got through mopping the floor well swiffer mop everything's pretty much clean in here i just try to keep it clean every day because y'all know me i do not like leaving my room and coming back to a dirty room so the goal for <laughs> my next uh 12 week in a year plan i'm right i just wrote it out last night part of it is to keep this empty and clean unless it's my gym bag or something i'm grabbing to go like in my bag my book or something but this is to not have clothes on it that's the goal <laughs> that's just a little small goal anyway so i'm taking my who is this teddy blake little cross bag because even though it's a little girl my camera fits in here everything fits in here keys i love this little bitty bag so i'm gonna take this put this up i just bought a new bottle from walmart a little spray bottle for my like those continuous sprays for my hair grab my phone and yeah room is clean y'all we clean all these other rooms, but it's something I want to work on, so I'll just take y'all with me. I don't know what this vlog is going to be about today, but for so far, I know I'm going to Target. I know I'm going to Hobby Lobby, and I know that I want to clean up. So for the fragrance of the day, I put on a Shea Butter like body cream that I already had made up. I added the Not Today Body Lotion because I wanted that Julia Has a Gun kind of light airy scent and then i spray a ton of the roses greedy from mancera and then of course <laughs> i topped it off with the just box brain dance y'all y'all see how much is in here like this is crazy yeah i'm really liking this scent so evidently that's what i'm wearing all right so this room is on the list to clean up and film today it's a mess i know um, I said I was going to do it last week, but we had a lot of stuff going on. Plus, I had to help a friend of mine out in her farm. Her husband recently passed. So he isn't here to feed his turtle. That is Jordan. All right, so this is what I plan on doing in the next, I, I guess within this week, right? I want to clean up this kitchen. Uh, some of the stuff is just the girl stuff. They just have stuff everywhere because they're out of school again. And I want to get these taken down. Maybe just keep one up. But these taken down because I like to grow in fall and winter. These, but I can't grow outside. What's in here will transfer outside. And these are the Click and Grow Hydroponics. Get them off the counter. Clean up the counters real good. I want to take that clock down. I guess I'm over it. I don't know. We don't even use it. It's just there. And... I want to clean up this area, put a vase here, and a bowl. I mean, a vase and something. I don't know what I want to put here. I kind of want like a little vase with greenery and a vase there that's not as tall. I'm going to move that vase somewhere else. This is what I, do, what I want to do. I don't know. I'm not sure yet. Yeah, I don't. I just want to do like a shorter fat vase, a, a fat vase there, a fat vase there, greenery there, greenery there. This plant is just here for right now. It's a pomegranate tree. I need to move it. It's actually bush. They're bushes. Pomegranate bush. And then clean up this area. The ice maker is just there for right now because I'm making a ton of ice for something. And um, just clean up this stuff. <laughs> clean it up. That's what I want to do. Just clean up. But no, really. I really wish I, I had a smaller table now. I don't do all of those bringing a bunch of people over hosting and all this stuff anymore. So I really wish I had a smaller table, but I don't. So we'll keep it. 
Um, I don't really have anywhere to put the extra chairs. If I take some of these chairs out, I kind of feel like I need to take some chairs out. Like it's too big, too crowded in here. So um, I might move this bench out in the garage, have the four chairs here. And then that'll leave me with, um, girl, if I take the four chairs. So that'll leave me with two chairs where me, I need to find somewhere for them to go. I wouldn't mind my grow tower being like right there or somewhere else. I had it one time right here, but it's too close to the door. We're in and out, in and out. And what happens is in the spring when we get a lot of humidity or whatever, we end up having, let me turn some light on. We end up having uh, like bugs from outdoors. So it's best to kind of like leave it over here. Yeah, it's best to leave it over here. And I can't put it anywhere else because Journey will eat my leaves in my plant but this is stuff i can't grow outside which is like normally lettuce i just harvested a bunch if you follow me on another channel you saw that um let me show you that i harvested a ton of lettuce and kale from my side chard from my side it's a bunch of green going on in here it's a bunch of pineapples because so we're about to chop and freeze some plus put some away in the refrigerator like in containers plus some for juicing today so that'll be on the other channel. I gotta do all that today because I need to get them pineapples out of my refrigerator. And so we got lettuce everywhere. But anyway, the goal is to have a I know the pot I want. Y'all, I know the pot I want. <laughs> Come on, hi but please have my pot on sale. But anyway, I kinda want a pot here. We used to just put like little brownies and stuff like that right in that little thing. But and the table's fine. Don't get me wrong. I love my table. I've had it for years. I found this furniture store. It's Big League Furniture here in Houston off of Murphy Road. And you just give them a number out of a catalog that you get from these big box stores. Like this table was like 2600 2400 with all these chairs and crap, right? For me, at that time, I paid like $590 something, an extra $100 for the bench, like $600 some dollars for all this. Yeah, it's crazy because the big box stores, like, you know, rooms going on, it charge a lot. Like, I think the markup is 60 70 percent whereas i was able to get this because they don't have an overhead they just order from the, the catalog the warehouse and deliver it to you so yeah you have to know what you want though you have have to have already seen it you know what i mean so you'll understand what you're getting but yeah i've had this table for years me and my dad had the same table but anyway and it had little studs and whatnot in the back so i want to clean this room up do my study so it's probably be two separate videos of what we're doing um, when it comes to cleaning and revamping some things, I want a rug right here because the dog told the rug, so I need another rug. I need a rug like in front of the sink right here. Some more like decorative towels, a rug right here. We'll clean up, wash down the cabinets, uh, do the Murphy oil for the cabinets and all that stuff. We'll clean up all this off the counters when it's time for us to clean for the kitchen and do something with this island to make it more appealing. Yes, girl, we got the mop water out and everything. All right, so over here, the goal is to figure out how to get Journey's cage and Quest cage upstairs. First of all, this cage is too small for Journey, but she wants to be in here, so we let her be in there. I think it's the closed knit thing, but I need to get them all back upstairs and get them out of my living room. So this is the kids' TV room. I say that, but this is like where everybody comes over and hang out because it's adjacent to the kitchen, right? So I'm thinking the other side. Oh, it's so bright in here, y'all. So that's Shaq um fiddle fig leaf i'm thinking about just moving it over there and just have a you know bookshelf and do some things in here i don't know not too much though not too much i don't want a lot of furniture in here at all i want to keep this really simple and yeah so we'll be doing a lot this week together so if you're interested come hang with me so i've already had my juice for the day this morning I think it was pineapple ginger and Pineapple, ginger, lemon. What was in that juice? Pineapple, ginger, lemon, cucumber. It was so good. So let me empty out this ice bucket. Look at this ice. I'm going to go ahead and eat something this morning just a little bit. My lips are probably dry. I don't take medicine and I was on antibiotics for everything that I had done and it just dried me, just sucked me dry. So I probably look oily right now because I've been just lathering my body, my face, my everything with shea butter and almond oil because, yeah.
devil.
another day. So this video is probably extremely long. My face is dirty. I know. <laughs> I know. Yeah. It's like a shea butter natural soap. I find at um, HEV sometime. I don't know the name of it. So my face is still sore right here. My jaw. Um, yeah. Oh my goodness, y'all. I keep having like sinus headaches from having, you know, when my sinuses was damaged from the surgery. Oh my goodness. But I'm trying not to take anything. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I want to do a facial mask too, but we got to clean up. We're on a mission. I'm just going to use some um, almond oil on my face. Oh girl, I need to do something with my head today. What are we going to use today to wash our hair? Well, we could be deep conditioning our hair while we're cleaning. Mm. Mm. Um, I'm tender headed. <laughs> so, I don't even comb my own hair, child. I know me braid it up and call it a day. Alright, let's. We are in the study. And I got paperwork everywhere that I'm supposed to be filling out and completing. I gotta clean this bookshelf and possibly get rid of a few books. I'm not getting rid of no books. <laughs> Psych. But um, yeah, let me go and start cleaning up. Let's turn the light on over here. I wanna put the dolls back in this hallway. So this needs to go, that luggage needs to find somewhere to be. Yes, my good friend's luggage there plus Terrace, and we need to put it somewhere so let's start here oh my god my plan is done oh my god my plan is done oh my god what just happened oh my god is it dead there like what is going on too much water. Okay, let's keep these pieces. Oh, okay. I swear I just watered this thing. I swear I just watered it. This is from, uh, what's that store? Um, Aldi. You know what? There's no hole in the bottom for the water to drain. Okay, so we'll redo, we'll repot this. <sighs> yeah, we will. All right, turn the queen. Fast forward and let's get cleaning. I know that fish tank looks extremely dirty. That's not my job as Christopher, so I'm not doing that. I actually use um, this. It is, it just says remove dust and fingerprints. It's by extreme, but it's really like for your monitors and stuff like that. I use it on my TV, of course. And then I haven't swept the mop or anything. I'll, all I've done was clean off this desk. And I had like some boxes under here that had some stuff I need to go through. So all that's trash now. And now I actually need to clean up this area. So I have a mini fridge up here because at one time I used to drink wine. Actually a lot of wine. And some look uh, And um, I kept it up here in the locked-in fridge. It's some downstairs too actually in the pantry to be honest. But I would keep it up here and I would have like sparkling water and stuff like that. Look how dirty and dusty this is. But anyway, I think it's basically empty now, except for like maybe a can or two of sparkling water and some coffee tequila that I used to pour into my coffee. Yeah, I need to get some sparkling water. Refill this up because I love a good old sparkling. And I need to clean this. 
in that area. Oh my God. For those who always ask about the bookshelf, it comes from Tribe Signs. It's linked in my link tree. I always leave all of their links to everything I have in my link tree. So I got the bookshelf from them. I actually purchased this desk from them. They sent me over this shelf for review. It's a little bit lighter um, than the actual bookshelf. But I do like the tone of it. It kind of just flows because my desk has the light tones um, that match the console as well as the darker tones that match the bookshelf. So, you see that in there? Yeah. So, anyway, my desk is cleaned off. I need to, like, sweep this rug out because we got to get another vacuum cleaner. We done mess up the other one. I'm going to wipe down this area right here. I need to get some more coffee pods. Because this is where sometimes I just make like the small coffees in here with the machine from Aldi. That's the Ambiano machine. And the Nespresso machines are downstairs. But anyway. Poor thing. Alright, so we're about to edit. I'm going to watch me some TV while we edit. But <laughs> let me show you. Let me come over here. So the hallway has been empty cleaned and all the things. Well, I didn't clean this mirror. Y'all know this is mirror from my bathroom from when I replaced my mirror. Mm -hmm. We just got to keep it so when I move, we can put that one back. I can take my mirror with me. But yeah, all this is clean. I just kind of like, I want to put a mat here that you could sweep and clean off or whatever. Kind of like a big, huge, like, I don't know. Almost like a mat you can vacuum. So I can put the dogs back up here and... There's a bookshelf right there that I need to empty, clean, and toss. I, I don't need that bookshelf. I don't even know what's on it. So anyway, everything's clean. I got to go to the post office today so I can get started on updating my passport and getting uh, Christopher and Penelope's passport together because they need one too. And bam, this is clean as it's going to get. <laughs> I need to order a vacuum cleaner though. Look, it's still trash on the floor. I did sweep them out, but uh, it is what it is. Yes. 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 All right. I'm out.